you should subscribe to games and graphics on YouTube. Yeah. Sure, <laughs> maybe I'll subscribe when I'm not busting perps, rookie. Okay, sounds good. Good enough for me. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right escapes graphics we are making a building with another gta 5 mod tutorial for you and today we are going to be installing the in world gta all right this is the sentient streets ai mod this one is created by block the worker block this is called in world gta and we are going to be installing this today okay so this first page that i'm on is the guide okay it's the user guide for in world gta 5 all right so what you want to do is read all of this important information all right it has a nice little uh setup right here on the side where it could take you directly to where the information is at let's jump into the requirements okay the prequisites right here first of all we are going to need script hook v by alexander blade we will not be installing script hook v although i will leave a link to a video showing you how to install script hook v if you don't have it already now the next thing up we are going to need is the mod itself okay there's two places where it could be downloaded at as of right now there's only one place that has it gta 5 mods is still waiting to approve it okay so right now i will leave a link that will lead you to nexus mods where you can download it okay and the next thing up will be scriptbookv.net this already comes inside of the mod as you can see this already comes with the mod because i use my own compiled version but you could download it from here okay that's the words of the creator in the last but not least you need a in-world account okay first of all we're going to go to this one right here to set up our in-world account when you select this link right here it's going to lead you to this website right here inworld.ai all right and this is the front page that you're going to see um, you could go ahead and select get started for free to get started for free i'm going to show you the pricing all right now the free this is what includes in the free okay 200 api and integration minutes okay now for the pro you're going to have 2000 api in integration minutes monthly all right this is for the pro for the free we only get 200 api now when these are up when uh we use all of our 200 api and in integration minutes in one day then we'll have to wait for the next day to get another 200 api integration minutes okay so with the free plan we do not have the option to buy more minutes when we run out but with the pro plan you have an option to buy more minutes once you run out okay so Let's go ahead and select it on free and then we are going to select subscribe okay you can select subscribe or select get started and once you select these buttons it's going to lead you to this page it's going to lead you to a page right here where it says welcome to the in world studio and this is where you can create your account for the in world studio all right so once you select whichever way that you are going to um, uh, create an account then you will be on another page which is this one right here okay this is going to be your in world workspace all right once you are here then we need to go back to the user guide all right now that we're back at the user guide now it's time to go ahead and download the mod okay so let's go ahead and select the nexus link right here nexus mods and this is going to lead you to this page right here this is going to be the nexus page for the download for in world sitting it streets ai story mod mode okay this one right here is created by block the worker block shout out to the creator um, when you get down to this page you can read the description as well it has a lot of information on here also after you're done reading this information come right here where it says files select files and select manual download okay i suggest to select manual download do not do not um, select mod manager download always select manual download especially for this one all right so once you select this and you have this downloaded on my left hand side i have in world sitting at streets ai story mode folder and on my right hand side i have my gta 5 directory open up i have my script book v installed and ready to go um, from this point in your gta 5 files you want to remove all mods okay remove all mods and all scripts 
um, just to make sure that this works okay so once you remove all mods and all scripts and then you install this and it works maybe you could add in a little script or mods here but this is created just to run on the vanilla game of GTA 5 which means just the regular version of the game with no mods included all right so that's the disclaimer right there make sure that you remove all mods before you install this now let's go ahead and open up the in world Sydney street folder open that one up and we are going to highlight everything that I have right here except the mod readme all right so we're going to take everything I have highlighted and we're going to drag and drop that over here to our GTA 5 directory once that has been dragged and dropped what we need to do is go back to our GTA 5 directory and look for in world folder okay the in world folder let's go ahead and open that up all right then we want to open up this dot env file right here you can open this up with a notepad or notepad plus i'm going to open this up with notepad plus got my notepad plus right here and i'm going to simply grab this and drag this over here all right now if you look inside of that dot env file it's going to say in world key and it will have your key in um quotes and then the second one will say in world secret and then it will have your secret in quotes we need to get these keys and these secrets from the website so let's go back to the website we are on the user guide right now where it explains on setting up your in world keys and if we scroll down there's a section right here that says steps to get and set the key okay now we have already had our in world um, workplace set up and as you can see there's a picture right here showing us where to go to start our um, our keys and stuff like that to get them all right so let's go back to our studio which is right here then we're going to scroll down and select integrations okay it's right underneath the connect is called integrations select that once you select your integrations um, this going to have this key right here that says generate new key okay so of course if this is your first time you want to go ahead and select generate new key after you select generate new key there will be a key and a secret right here generated underneath what you want to do is just simply copy the secret I mean you want to copy the key you want to copy the key then you want to bring up your notepad where you had um, your dot env opened up and you just simply want to highlight your key and paste your new key that you just got right over the words your key you want to make sure that it is in between the quotes okay so keep it in between the quotes once that has been entered in let's go back to our workplace and we want to copy the secret now so copy the secret bring back up your notepad highlight the word your secret in between the quotes and paste over it all right so you can have your in world secret right here so by now you should have your in world key and your in world secret after that you can go ahead select file and save all right another thing I want to go over slightly is the how to use okay we're just going to go ahead and read this once you install the mod and start GTA 5 you should see a terminal pop up and open on the background sometimes it can show in front as well this is fine please do not close it it says press this key on your keyboard this little uh, key right here this should this little key right here should be um, on the left side of the keyboard on the left side of number one at the top row of your keyboard okay it should be right there all the way far to the left on the left side of number one at the top row of your keyboard all right now once you press this key on your keyboard it should open cheat menu once that opens you want to type in go in world and press enter this mod comes with its own save system every time you pass a mission it automatically saves this is separated from gta 5's auto save system but it's still better to disable auto save from game settings you can connect the characters by pressing t once connection is established you can press and hold to in and speak to your microphone if soundtrack is kicked in you can decrease the volume by pressing control plus the down arrow and you can increase it by pressing control plus the up arrow following commands can be used by everyone all right so the first command that we want to use to start a new game once the game comes on is go in world okay now if you wanted to load a previously saved game after you have a saved game then we could type in load in world now if you already started a new game and you're already playing and you want to leave then you want to type in the command leave in world all right 
but leave in world mod it's still better to close your game if you want to play without the mod fix my car if you somehow throw your car to somewhere this will fix your car and replace it next on the street all right then you got some general tips and things of that type of nature so let's go ahead and minimize anything that we might have open and run the game all right now that we are in the game you've probably seen that little window that we read about earlier that's going to pop up do not close it just minimize it that's helping the mod connect itself to whatever it needs to connect to for it to work all right so once we're in the game we want to press that little key that we had read about earlier it's the left side of the keyboard on the left side of number one all right so let's go ahead and press that it's going to open up a cheat code box what we need to do is type in in lowercase go in world all right go in world press enter and from this point you will see your character has been teleported and you're also a different character and you should see a name box right here this is where you create your name i'm going to go ahead and type in games when you're done typing in your name press enter then you will see sitting at streets ai mod right there top left of the screen to say approach available partners and press e to select your partner now, before you're able to talk to people, you are definitely going to need a working mic, okay? If you're using headphones, uh, make sure that you're using your headphones to have a mic, all right? If you're using a mic, then uh, make sure you can hear it through the TV screen, I guess. But you just need a mic, all right? <laughs> all right, so if you want to talk to somebody, let's press T. And you'll see getting the attention of Frank Thomas. And when it does have his attention, it'll say, person is now listening. Press and hold in to talk. How's it going, Frank? Ah, uh, just another day in the concrete jungle, partner. Keeping the wolves at bay. All right. Do you mind if I uh, include you inside my tutorial? Well, as long as you don't mind me sharing some hard-earned wisdom from the trenches. Just remember, the streets don't play by the rules. <laughs> sounds good, sounds good. All right, let's go ahead and uh, talk to this guy also. Now we have three options of a partner that we get to pick. That was Frank, this is Tony. Let's get Tony's attention by pressing T before we speak. We gotta press T to get his attention. Now he is listening, now we can talk. Hey, what's going on Tony, how you doing today? Uh, just another day in the life of a top-notch officer, my friend. Keeping the streets safe and the pockets lined. Hmm. Can't complain. Nice, nice, nice. Um, do you watch YouTube? YouTube? Nah, I'm too busy patrolling the mean streets, keeping the scumbags in check. <laughs> okay, sounds nice, sounds nice. <laughs> you should subscribe to Games and Graphics on YouTube. Yeah. Sure, <laughs> maybe I'll subscribe when I'm not busting perps, rookie. Okay, sounds good. Good enough for me. All right, uh, Frank, I'll catch you later. Or was this Tony? I think this is Frank. Sure thing, rookie. Stay out of trouble and remember, it's all about the Benjamins. It's all about the Benjamins, right? <laughs> so, you have uh, those two guys right there. Tony, Frank, and uh, I believe this is going to be uh, Emily. Something like that. It's my favorite girl right here. What's going on, Emily? Let's go ahead and get her attention. Emily Martinez. Now she is listening. How are you doing today, Emily? Did you bust anybody? Oh. You know me, always keeping the streets safe and the bad boys in check. Just another day in the life of Officer Sparkplug. But enough about that. Tell me, have you ever been on a wild car chase? Because I've got a need for speed that just can't be tamed. I sure haven't. <laughs> I don't plan on being in no high speed car chase neither. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead. Uh, we're not going to go through the whole uh, thing of um, doing crimes or anything like that, but you can talk to people as well the same way that we're talking to these officers. You will have some crimes where you will have to interview witnesses or whatnot, and it's the same procedure to talk to them as well. All right, so as soon as you um, find whichever police character that you want to come with you, you just want to press the E key. I believe the E key is going to make that person join with you. So when I press the E key, at the bottom it says partner is now selected. 
it says go to your car to start your day your partner will follow you all right so once you get in the car your partner will follow you okay let's get in the car and it says wait for your partner and start patrolling now from this point you can just drive around and you will be getting calls okay when you get calls there will be a gps that will pop up on your map and you want to follow that gps to whatever call it may be all right so we're going to go ahead and end the tutorial right here but if this helped y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video feel free to smash that like button for me definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with your friends that are in the modding gta 5 y'all this well, is games and graphics hot me and my partner we're out of Looks here like we've next got ourselves time. a pool party crasher time to bust out the floaties and show off our synchronized swimming skills i hope you're ready to make a splash partner oh honey with my charm and your good looks We'll have all the skins and graphics we need. We'll be the stars of Los Santos, turning heads and stealing hearts. No need to rush out of here just yet, sweet cheeks. We've got plenty of time to strut our stuff. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.